A new poll released Monday finds that support for the DPP's presidential ticket is at 45 per cent. Approval for the KMT's ticket KMT's ticket comes in second at 29 per cent. The People First Party's bid trails in third with 8 per cent. At a press conference on Monday, the KMT caucus said the Tsai Lai ticket was purely a political calculation. Lai Qingde was forced into this marriage. In the primary, the two of them were lashing out at each other and drawing blood. Now she is running with Lai Qingde. Does this mean she agrees with Lai Qingde's Taiwan independence ideology? Can this type of union be forced? Tsai Ing-wen chose Lai Qingde after a comprehensive assessment. What does Lai mean when he says he has a pragmatic approach to promoting Taiwan independence? It goes back to the DPP's charter. Any change to the nation's status must be agreed on by the people of Taiwan. New polls give the latest sentiment on the presidential tickets. The Tsai Lai pairing has 45 percent support, well ahead of the KMT's 29 percent. The People First Party's ticket has 8 percent. As for the party ballot, the DPP has caught up with the KMT, and the two are even at about 29 percent. The Taiwan People's Party ranks third, followed by the People First Party and the New Power Party. This was a serious warning for the KMT. We hope that every party member can tackle this issue and put forward solutions. For the DPP, the Tsai Lai ticket is proving a plus. Meanwhile, the KMT's party list has turned out to be a net minus. As events unfold, the KMT is seeing the loss of its edge in the legislative race.